Hi and welcome. I'm Joe Bryan and I'll be your guide through video one on how to create and set up your Facebook fan page the right way. Uh, setting up a Facebook fan page is easy but following these few simple tips will make your fan page way more visible to search engines, uh, search engine optimization, easier to find on Facebook search and more successful with your fans. Um, just a couple of examples here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and log into my personal account. We had a client that uh, O'Shea's old in, and this they had actually, as many businesses have, had set up their uh, personal profile um, before realizing they needed a fan page. But um, as you can see, uh, when you just land on a business's wall, there's uh, not a lot of information here. I mean, it's not really clear to take activity or direction. Um, you're not really expressing uh, a message and uh, you know you could go to these other tabs and find some information but uh, uh, it doesn't jump out at you. Um, we just recently created a uh, fan page for O'Shea's for their music uh, and entertainment schedule and now uh, we're phasing out the, uh, the personal profile but uh, as you can see here we have a large um, profile image. This is valuable real estate a lot of people don't take advantage of where you can put uh, information here. We'll show you some other examples of that as we move along. Um, we have our logo header here and uh, we have embedded a custom YouTube channel. One advantage to doing this is that you can update the content on your Facebook fan page through YouTube without actually having to go in and recode or change the, uh, the video information. Uh, in this case uh, it's uh, actually a commercial for O'Shea's. You'll see the low ceiling beams, hear the traditional live music, smell the fine fare, and think to yourself, wow, I'm in one of Ireland's best pubs. This was actually put together uh, simply with images uh, that had been taken, and uh, uh, the uh, material, the narration was from a radio spot, and it was done with Windows Movie Maker, so you can see it's pretty easy to put together something obviously if you have uh, TV ads uh, these could go directly to the to the fan page um, moving along um, we have uh, external links um, we actually created a uh, uh, live stream television station for O'Shea's but um, these links could be to any site um, we have a YouTube channel here um, we also have a share button encouraging people to share this page with friends And uh, we also have uh, connections to the existing website. Now, one advantage of the Facebook fan page uh, is that in this particular case, the, the website had basically remained uh, stagnant for a long period of time. The person that designed it wasn't around anymore. And this is the case often with a lot of businesses that have someone set up a website for them and there's no, no change. Um, the ability to uh, update the fan page and and uh, constantly uh, keep adding information uh, not only increases uh, traffic to your website but increases your search engine rankings. Um, just a couple more examples of some links here. Uh, uh, we have uh, links to uh, restaurant reviews and uh, as you can see this site's Facebook enabled so uh, we could go ahead and say that we like this. <laughs> but uh, the key thing is when you're setting up your site is to take the best advantage of, uh, of, of getting your message out and that's going to be focusing on an eye-catching uh, image, uh, in many cases your logo or your brand, but uh, something that grabs attention. Um, and then having a custom welcome tab for uh, new visitors or non-fans to land on uh, so that uh, uh, you can put out all of your information, links to your other sites. Um, in this case, our site is an example of a site that uh, encourages a call to action. Um, 
in this case uh, uh, you can see there's this click the like button immediately here and it says if you become a fan you get free uh, design tips and uh, in this case uh, once again the profile image here and we tell people to click the like button and even have a reminder to suggest this page to your friends. Now you'd be very very surprised how these few simple tricks will greatly greatly uh, enhance the number of conversions that you get of people liking your page and um, having someone like your page keeps you in contact it spreads throughout their news feed and they're updated whenever you are updating information about your page um, so uh, just simple little tricks like this can can rapidly increase your fan base and and your free marketing base um, now once uh, you go ahead and click the like button in this case uh, our special code recognizes that we are now a fan and uh, you uh, you get this uh, basically it's a sales squeeze page in this particular case um, and scrolling down you can see that we have a button to uh, to go ahead and share this um, we have uh, the ability to tweet it posted on buzz and we have uh, you know the ability to add any of the social media networks uh, that we want to share to um, we have an email capture form this is most important here is, is that we've now gotten them to become a fan of the page and now we're encouraging them by getting this free video the one that you're watching now uh, that uh, uh, they will give us an email address so that we can stay in contact with them as uh, we you know have new product releases and etc cetera, etc cetera. Um, going down you can see that we have a, uh, a YouTube video here uh, this is something you might want to watch that uh, uh, interesting st stats and one of the many reasons why it's so important for business to be on Facebook is because of the 500 million users and uh, the fact that uh, you, most of these users log in two to three times a day and uh, um, the ability to use Facebook ads to target market your audience is uh, uh, vastly superior to uh, Google AdWords and other you know cost per click type of advertising campaigns so anyway without further ado um, just wanted to give some basic examples there and uh, we'll drill down on this as we go ahead um, to uh, get started, um, I'm going to get to facebook.com. I'm going to go ahead and sign out of my account here. 